Uh, this is Dave from CheapBooks.com playing Airline Manager 4. Got a problem with an aircraft. It's in Punta Arenas, and Punta Arenas is, it's okay, but when you got high-capacity aircraft that hold a lot of passengers, you're going to run into problems with Punta Arenas. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to fix a problem. You see Punta Arenas over here? Look what it says over here, demand. It says 1942.9. And look over here what it says. It says 1942.9. And the reason why they're identical is because they're both going to the same airport. It was a mistake that I made, and I'm going to fix it. And the way I'm going to fix it, obviously, is by creating a new route. You know, it's funny. I don't see an option for a route. And the reason why is, is because it is in the air. So I'm going to ground the aircraft so that when it lands, uh, I'll remember to take a look at it, even though I'm probably going to forget. Okay, so we're going to look at another aircraft. This one is Punta Arenas going to Russia. So Punta Arenas is not a great hub. It did work out well for me. I got a lot of flights out of Punta Arenas. But uh, let's look at the demand. Oh, you know what? It is good. It's got 344 and 127. Okay, so I'm going to keep it. So I'm going to try and fix this route over here. Uh, the reason why I grounded it is because it's only get, getting ticket prices of 7300 I want more like 8000 So I'm going to do an international route. I'm probably going to come out of here. You know what? That's amazing. And we're going to end up in Russia somewhere, right? That's 73. In fact, that is the existing route, as far as I'm, I know. 7,000. So that was a better route up there. 8,044. Look at that. That's beautiful. And I don't have a route to Irkutsk. 309.76.48. This is going to be tough. Because... I don't know if this is an illusion or not. This is an illusion, so that means it's not going to be tough because it doesn't have as many passengers. So what I got to do, the 26, 48, 70, 76, 218, 309, you know what? This was a mistake. I understand that it cost me money. It's not that big of a deal. Can I fix this? Um, it's going to be difficult to fix because there's just not enough demand it will deplete the demand that's what is what's going to happen so i'm going to move it out of here i'm going to switch it to another hub i'm going to look at one of my new hubs i already know that lima's kind of packed right singapore i don't know if singapore is good but it looks like it's also kind of packed. Chicago, I happen to know it doesn't have any good um, routes. However, there's a trick that you can use, which is you don't fly from Chicago to the distant city. You fly from the distant city to Chicago. I know it doesn't make sense. Um, it's a, I know it's a problem hub, so we're not going to do Chicago. I was disappointed with Chicago. Buenos Aires. It's packed. These are all going to China. Cocos is probably packed. Yeah, it's packed. I want to buy a new hub, but I don't have enough points. Canberra. You know, I could give Canberra a shot. Perth. Perth doesn't have a lot of flights. 
So I am going to look at the ticket price, 81. You know what? I'm going to move this plane to Perth. Take this plane. I am going to reroute. Not going to do a ferry flight. Man, I am hungry. Okay, it's too far. Gotta do it again. Gonna look for Perth, which I believe is that Perth over here? Can't see. Looks like Bruno. Okay, so it's not going to let me pick Perth. Um, I'm going to go to... Well, let me take Canberra also. I'm going to fly nearby over here. And then I am going to create the route. <clears throat> and I'm going to depart the plane. Then I'm going to ground it. What's going to happen is when it gets there, I'm going to be, why is this plane grounded? It's right next to Perth. And then I'm going to use the uh, feature to route it directly into Perth. Problem will, be so <coughs> problem will be solved. I've done it many times before. So now this is the one going to Nigeria. And the reason why is because I was thinking about purchasing this hub but I don't have enough points. I need two more points. Um, so we're going to check the hubs again. Because i got to find a place that isn't too crowded. The next hub I'm going to buy is going to be Hawaii. Could try Sydney. Sydney's kind of crowded. If it's crowded, that means all the best spots were already taken. I know that Taiwan's probably empty. Seventy six hundred. Okay, let's see if I can buy a hub in Taiwan in Hawaii. So I'll just randomly pick one like. Honolulu. Honolulu is going to be expensive, right? Hilo. 20 points. Honolulu is 20 points. That one's 20 points. That one's 20 points. That one's 20 points. Okay, I know you're going to say I need two more points. Guess what I'm doing? I have a flight that's going to do an achievement that's going to earn me the points. Did I miss one? Whatever the last one I was, I thought it said 10. Okay, let's check Nigeria. 20. 20. Just so you know, the points and the cost increase as you make more money. Okay, I can't find anything. So I want to get some value out of this aircraft. And he is in Nui. I will see if I can reroute him. I have no idea where he's going to end up. 72, 7,000, 74, 78's actually pretty good, but I don't know if I've got another flight coming into there. I'm just going to do it. <clears throat> 